Okay, guys, so basically in this segment, we're trying to explain the different parts of a, of a linear equation. Um, this is y, and it's equal to mx plus b, where m is the slope and b is the y-intercept. We can actually transpose or rearrange these um, variables. For instance, this equation could have also been written this way, so that we could actually find what the y-intercept was if we had an x value and a y value, and if we were given the slope, which was m. Let us consider this table here of values, x and y. In this case, let x be the independent variable and y be the dependent variable, where y is actually dependent on the value of x. As we can, as we can see, m or the slope is just simply delta y over delta x or the change in y over the change in x. Then we can introduce different terms like the domain and the range. The domain is actually an independent variable and the range is actually a dependent variable. So guys, if you were given a question that asked you or a similar question like this that asks you to state the domain and the range, you would just look at the values given the domain would be the x values and it would be 1 and 6 because these are the values 1 through 6. And this is how you write it. And then you would just... And then if you want to state the range, you would just simply list the values in the table, which was this. The y values would be the squiggly lines like if you were writing um, set notation. And then you would put 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. So y would just be the range. You just list the